Rose, right center. Down base hit. Could he go three? India around third. India scores. It's a cycle. This rookie in two weeks in the big leagues posts the first cycle for a red since 1989. Ellie Mania. In the air to right. McCarthy back. Grand slam! First career granny! Opposite way in a big way. It's 9-3. This ball hit hard. That one out to right. That could be trouble. That one's gone! Three straight home runs for the Rangers! 17th of the year for low. That was an absolute rocket off the bat. From Nathaniel Lowe at 107 miles an hour against the Jimmy Hergett slider. Here's a swing and a looper to first. Casas gloves it and then flips backhanded to Whitlock, who covers the bag and beats Taylor there. And that is a beautiful play for out number two. Swing and a high fly into deep left center field. It's carrying well. It is back. It is gone. Tristan Casas does it again. Left-handers, not named Barry Bonds, do not do that in this ballpark. It's the Casas show by the Bay, and it's two nothing Red Sox. I mean, I mean, there's hot, and then there's Tristan Casas. There's a drive to deep right field. Renfro back. He's out of room. It's out of here. Josh Naylor has put the Guardians on top. They're hysterical at Progressive Field. A three-run bond to right. Josh Naylor in the eighth inning for the second night in a row. Swing at a high fly ball, left field deep. Quan will turn at the wall. That ball is back, and that ball is gone. A grand slam. He's done it again. Royce Lewis for the fourth time in his career, third time this season, has hit a grand slam, and the Twins take a 6-0 lead here in Cleveland. Fly ball, left field, Gabriel Moreno has hit a grand slam in Slam Diego. And the Diamondbacks are taking over, it's 8-1. Go, go, Gabby! Oh, that was a no-doubter. That was the happy Gilmore swing, and he got it. Out to left field, driven well, socked deep, Cal Raleigh, there it goes! Number 28 for Cal Raleigh, it's a new career high! And an all-time single-season franchise record for a Mariners catcher, set once again for the second straight year by Cal Raleigh! 1-1. Tapper back toward the mound. Cease has to bear him. Give it a throw, what a play! Oh, Dylan Cease! All that yoga comes in handy. Swing and a miss. Slider still effective over that century mark. Strikeout number 11 for Dylan. Payoff pitch. And that is strike three called. A new career high for Rivaldi. 12 punch outs tonight. And of course, it was on a fastball. Fastball has been so live all season long, but especially here tonight. And to this side of the plate, he has been very dominant. There it is at 96 miles an hour. 3 2 pitch, strike three. A strikeout of Renfro. And Montgomery with his season high tie, ninth strikeout as he walks off the mound to complete the top of the six. Pulled sharply towards third. That's a fair ball. Diving grab made in foul territory by Chapman. On to first by Chapman to get the out. What a spectacular sprawling play by Matt Chapman. There's a ground ball right side. <laughs> Kim twists and fires and gets his man. Able to get Vaughn. What a play by Ha Song Kim. In the air to left field. Back goes De La Cruz at the wall. Grand slam! It's Slam Diego for Hassan Kim. His first grand slam of his career. Padres take a 5-0 lead. And a big 
base hit to left. One run is scored. Here comes Suzuki and the throw to the plate from Jones in time. Out at the plate. He's done it again. Nolan Jones with his 15th outfield assist. As this is hitting the air to right field, Santander makes the catch and taking extra bases away from Volpe. Boy, how good was this, huh? This Oriole defense has been on fire. Santander to right. Santander to right. And this baby's gone. Some magic on a Friday night in downtown Baltimore. And the Orioles walk off New York and they win the game 1 0. He swings and drives it deep to left field. This ball is gone. Career homer number 300 for J.D. Martinez. Oh, how do you like it? A two-homer night for J.D. 2-2 two -two is shot to right on a line. Suzuki with a sliding catch. Seiya Suzuki, perennial gold lover in Japan, shows off some of that ability right there. Hendricks winds, kick steals. Drilled towards right center field. Suzuki on the move. Oh! Sale, what a grab! Probably the best catch we've seen him make. 3 1 and a deep drive again. Back to the seats and his second home run of the night. Osuna doing more damage. And the Braves have their first lead of the ball game. It's 4 to 3 in the bottom of the fourth inning. A swing and there's a drive hit deep right center field that ball's gone three run homer Wilson Contreras two home runs tonight and six RBIs 14 to 8 Cardinals you think Wilson Contreras is having fun as a Cardinal tying run at the plate Contreras deep in the left center and we are tied his longest home run of the season. 456 feet over everything out there in left center. My goodness. Wearing number 21 on his back for Roberto Clemente. Contreras hits an absolute bomb out of here. We're tied at three. He struck him out. Five Met pitchers combined for the second no hitter in New York Mets history. And Diaz puts on the finishing touches, striking out the side of the ninth inning. Struck him out, and the ball game is over. Edwin Diaz puts out the fire. A one-two. There it is. Awfully impressive performance from Edwin Diaz. He strikes out the side in the ninth. Oh my! Max Power, deep right field, heads up in the third deck. I mean, this was ridiculous. <laughs> this ball was sick. Smuncy into right, and it's a one-run. Oh my goodness. Look how extended he gets right here. What a beautiful swing. And he has just tied a Dodger franchise record with an extra base hit in his ninth straight game. There's a high shot back into left. Head zone to the wall. Goodbye. Home run Paredes. He shocked Paredes with number 29. How about getting on top of that? That fastball with some elevations closing in on the letters. And boy, does he unload again. And a drive back into deep left, and that baby's going to get out of here. Three run blast for Isak Paredes. Deep to right center. Josh Lowe has hit it out. A two run shot. And the Rays here at the bottom of the eighth break the tie. And they're measuring that shot at 452. Sounded like it. I mean, what a blast to right center. High shot, straightaway center, and that baby is out of here. 20 home runs, 32 stolen bases, now 81 runs batted in. Fly ball, well hit, right center, and it's gone. The second home run of the game for George Springer. What a day for George Springer. Line drive right center field Springer racing over and he caught it. What a spectacular catch by George Springer. One of the best you'll ever see folks. Swing and a miss for strike three. Congratulations George Kirby career strikeout number 200.
in his young big league career and plenty plenty more where that came from. Swing and a miss. 97 mile an hour fastball. It's a career night for George Kirby. Ten strikeouts over six stellar innings. And that is strike three. Comes back with some low heat right there at 97. That fastball still jumping, and Devers just can't pull the triggers. That ball closes in on him. And he comes back with a strikeout there. Back to back strikeouts, 13 in the game. Oh, he got him looking. Strike three call, six strikeouts in a row. Three up, three down in the six. Oh, and two. Altuve chases strike three. And there's the ninth strikeout for Kyle Bradish in a big, big moment. 2 2. And a swing and a miss. Three more strikeouts for Kyle Bradish. Yell, it's into left field. That ball's hit well. And this one is gone. Oh my goodness. Yelich to center field, towering fly ball. That one is gone. And Christian Yelich having a night in Miami, his second home run. Five RBIs for Yelich, two homers and a double, and it's 16 to nothing. A fly ball to center field, deep. Has he done it again? Clear the deck, cannonball coming, he crushed it. Anchor down, Brian Reynolds. Send this ball to center field, Robert back to the track, approaching the wall, clear the deck, cannonball coming, anchor down, the Major League home run leader, that's five, gives the Bucks the lead. There's a long fly ball from Brandon Nimmo, and this game is tied. Home run number 20 for Brandon Nimmo, a new career high. One, two coming. And a high fly ball hit deep to left center field. Back in the gap goes Nimmo on the warning track. Right at the fence. He made the catch. He timed it perfectly. In full stride right at the top of the fence. Nimmo pulls it down. There's a drive deep down the line. Right field. Bye-bye. A grand slam. And the Mariners have an 8 nothing lead. J.P. Crawford back to back. Dynamic nights. On the ground. Crawford able to keep his feet tough throw it is in time my goodness J.P. Crawford bouncer to short nice stop Correa comes up firing and got him got a platinum glove for a reason a drive to left back and gone Carlos Correa's signature moment in his year and a half for the twins on the ground Backhand, sliding stop, Swanson unloads. Gorgeous. Yeah. Nobody makes that play better than him. That's the signature play for him, isn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Here's a deep drive to left. Dansby Swanson takes one deep. And the Cubs now lead four to nothing. That's his 20th of the year. That was a rocket to the seats. Ozzie Albies, high and deep to right. There goes number 30 for Ozzie Albies. And Atlanta has a two to nothing lead. Two batters in. Ozzy line drive. Base hit. Reynolds coming home. Safe. The Braves have done it again to the Chicago Cubs. Ozzy Albies delivers the game winning hit. Sends this to center. Friedel backing up. Still backing up. Backing up. Looking up. And it's gone. Cattell Marte, his second home run tonight. And a four RBI night for Cattell. Marte, this is well struck to center. And there it goes. Cattell Marte sends one out of here. 25th for Cattell. They want the strikeout. Dubbing it two. Folks rise to their feet. A career high 11 strikeouts, Justin Steele. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Justin Steele, eight shutout, a career high dozen strikeouts. He is an ace. 2 2 coming. Struck him out. Sega goes up and in with the fastball to get Berger for the second time and strand a pair. Eight strikeouts for Kodai Sega. And he struck him out with a fork ball. Ten strikeouts for Sega. And he got him for a third time. Justin Verlander, seven strikeouts for JV. And he dots him up with a fastball instead. 
Swing and a foul tip caught by Maldi. That'll be another big strikeout for Verlander. Seven strikeouts in the game. Two, two pitch. Thomas strikes out swinging. That's nasty. Guy Tellez goes down swinging. Nasty. That's a good split right there. Oh my goodness. Look at this thing drop right here. And Yamamoto wears number 18. That's the ace of the pitching staff. Save situation for Josh Hader with the Padres on top, five to two. Strike three, two down in the ninth inning. He struck him out, and the Padres win. The save for Hader. Josh Hader on to try and finish this thing off. He needs but one out. Flores went, and the ball game is over. Josh Hader comes on to finish the job. No balls and two strikes. Williams deals. He got him. A strikeout to end it. Devin Williams comes on in a nothing nothing game in the ninth. Williams a 3 2. A swing and a miss. He struck him out. Got him with the fastball. Devin Williams strikes out Aaron Judge. Puts up a zero in the ninth. 2 2 to Blackman. Smothered by the gold glover. Walker beats Blackman to the bag. Corbin still holding. Walker gets it in the air. Deep left center. Christian Walker. Another big day for Walker in this bullpen. Christian hits it up in the air. It's carrying to center. Doyle backing up to the track, to the wall. And that one's in the bullpen. Christian Walker. It's 3 0. Oh. There's a towering fly ball to deep right field. It is gone. Fly ball, right center field. That's well hit. It is gone. Kyle Schwarber with his second home run of the night. Crushed. Good Deep Lord. to right field. Wow. Oh, my gosh. Holy cow. That went 483 feet. And now the 2 2 pitch, strike three. And the 0 2 pitch, swing and a miss, and down he goes. And another strikeout for Lopez. Strikeout number 10. Six straight strikeouts for Pablo Lopez and 11 in the game. A career high, 12 strikeouts. Two down. Ball game over. Pablo Lopez throws his first career complete game shutout. A big day for Fromber Valdez to try and get things rolling. Swing and a miss. That's a good start for Fromber Valdez. Swing and a miss. Got him on the curve. Good morning, good afternoon, and good night. The pitch. Fastball guy. Six strikeouts for Fromber. That's strikeout number seven. It's Looper, Pena, no hitter for Fromber Valdez. First lefty in franchise history. Luis Castillo trying to turn things around. 99 mile an hour heater. I had 0-2 to Jace Peterson. Oh, he is getting calls. He is throwing gas. He is in a groove early. Swing and a miss struck him out. He's gone. Swing and a miss for strike three. Luis Castillo knows it. Career strikeout number. Runs batted in for Bogarts and a high fly ball deep left field. It is gone. Xander Bogarts takes it into a sea of San Diegans. And he goes in a high fly ball center field. At the wall. Gone. Home run. X marks the spot. Gone. A two run home run for Xander Bogarts. They walk it off. Guerrero with the bases loaded. And he launches this one to left field. Grand Slam Vladdy! And do you believe it? His first at bat after winning the home run derby. Oh boy, did he ever! Accident 01. That one back! A belly bomb with the bases full, and the Cubs have unloaded here. Taylor back, back some more, out of here! A belly bomb. He's done it again! Another belly bomb. First and second and one out. Harris puts bat on ball. There's a drive to deep center field. And the Atlanta Braves are gonna walk it off this afternoon. The hometown kid is the hometown hero. the ballpark tonight. Sonny Gray today, 12 strikeouts, which matches a career high. Here's McCormick. He's seen Gray twice and struck out. 
Strike three called. There it is. 13 strikeouts for Sonny Gray. A new career best. He threw it right at the target, but he's got so much movement that the hitter just gives up on it and it just runs back over the plate. And man, has he been good today. And it's the Southern California kid, Max Free, back in his hometown, making the start against the Dodgers tonight. Season high, nine strikeouts for Max Free. Another one, 10 strikeouts for Max Free. Back in his hometown, throws a masterpiece, and he leaves with a 5 0 lead after seven. I'd say Max is fully back now from the three month absence. I think he looks all right tonight. <laughs> the 24 consecutive games of the home run, surpassing the Rays streak from earlier this year for the longest in baseball. And that one is drilled deep. He's going to do it again. Sean Murphy's having a season. A 25th straight game for the Braves with a home run to tie their franchise record. Through the raindrops and into the apple orchard. Real Muto comes to the plate. As Real Muto slams one deep left, Philadelphia has the lead. A three run homer from JT Real Muto. And with one swing, the Phillies are on top. Oh my gosh. This is crushed to center by Real Muto. Gone! Way gone! Phillies take the lead. Dodgers came from behind yesterday with two in the seventh and three in the eighth. And there's a fly ball to center field and deep way back at the wall. Gone! Will Smith with a home run over the wall and straight away center field. And the Dodgers have tied the score. And Smith with a two run blast and we're all knotted up. Bregman's had a big night. He has three hits. He's also got a walk. He has not had a career four hit game. He sends this one deep to left field. It is far. It's gone. Alex Bregman has put the Astros ahead. His first career four hit night. Bregman drills one deep to left field and that is up and out. Alex Bregman, number 22 on the air, takes a 2-1 pitch into the monster seats, and it's 1-0 Astros. Early Braggy bomb. That was a rocket at 105 off the bat. Luis Arise, second most singles in baseball last year, needs one of those right here for the first cycle in the history of the Marlins, the last team without one. And that is going to get down a base hit. The first cycle in Marlins franchise history, Luis Arise. The final piece of the puzzle, the last team in baseball without one. And Luis Arise is the guy. That is incredible. Congratulations. Well, when he walked out of the dugout and started going towards the mound, and they got a big cheer in the ballpark when everybody saw he was going out there. He's never had a complete game. Two down in the ninth. Ninth strikeout. Got him! And that's the ball game. Ten strikeouts and a complete game shutout for Logan Webb. Kevin Gosman on the mound today. He's been a strike throwing machine against the Yankees, and if he can do that again tonight, without Judge in the lineup, he should be able to carve up this young Yankee lineup. Swing and a miss with a fastball up, two down. That's how you do it. Two two from Gosman, and a swing and a miss. Chase that splitter, one down, and an awkward swing and a miss at a splitter that broke way in on him, and that's five strikeouts for Gosman. In the air, out to right, racing forward. Springer's there, makes the catch to retire the side. Kevin Gosman there to high five him, helping keep this game scoreless. And the liner into right center. That ball is going to drop, and the Rays are going to win it. Wow, scores Randy Rosarena with the game winner. He loves these moments. Well, what can you say? Dolis hits that one high in the air, deep out to left. And he hammers that baseball off the left field. A day redeemed for El Bombi. And what a moment for the Texas Rangers. Much needed. A 6 5 walk off win. And a shot into right. Hernandez will go back. That ball. It's going to go. Line drive.
Alonzo drives one. Deep left field. Really going back. It's <laughs> out of here. And the Mets win it. <laughs> Into the second deck. Alonzo, a three-run shot. And the Mets walk it off for the first time this year. The two youngsters kept the minute. And the best home run hitter in baseball wins it in the bottom of the tenth with a three-run blast. Oh, my Launched out boy. to left. Goodbye. Three home runs for Paul Goldschmidt. The reigning National League most valuable player has been the most valuable player of the day today. Change up. Oh, he got a change up. <laughs> and he hit it a long way to left center, and it's gone. And he got all of that one, and all of a sudden, the Blue Jays have the lead. Henderson tags it right field toward the wall and gone! Left on left, he left the yard! The Orioles have the lead! Come on, kid! Lefty on lefty, it just doesn't matter. Now backhand play, look at that throw off try! Unbelievable! He's putting on the clinic today, everybody. This is a joke. He doesn't even know what foot to throw off here. He just kind of jumps. That's the wrong foot, by the way. He just didn't want to take another another step. I don't think I've seen anyone better at that in this game ever. No strike, swing drive. Deep left field. That ball is gone. He can jump home. Nolan Arenado, a walk off big fly. A three-run shot into the bleachers, and the Cardinals walk it off here at Bush Stadium. High drive, right field. Watch it go. It is gone, and it is tied. That pitch might have been below the ankles. <laughs> he golfed it out. Ground ball up the middle. Perdomo's got it. Race to the bag. And Gallon's got the shutout. Zach Gallon's first career nine inning complete game shutout ends on this play. Whew. A step in time really does save nine this time. And Gallon has got it. Nine strikeouts, one walk, one hit batter. He gave up only three hits, all singles. 2 2. Another strikeout. That is number 12. He struck out at least once everybody in his lineup. And I think a lot of times, watch where these pitches are that these guys are offering him. They're out of the zone. A swing and a miss, and there is number 200. And it comes at a big time. His 200th strikeout comes with the bases loaded. A milestone again for Corbin Burns. One two pitch swing and a miss. That's number 12. He's got a dozen strikeouts today and two outs here in the eighth inning. It's just pure filth pure filth. I don't know how else to describe it. I mean he's got them all working today too. Yeah. On the ground that's fair and that is that. See you later Sox win. As he touches home plate, the White Sox walk off the Marlins. Sometimes it only takes one at bat. And he ran into one, a slider that was left over the plate, a mistake by Floro. Here comes Fernando. He's going to steal home. Fernando Tatis Jr. just walked in. Wow. 5-2. Don't take your eye off him. He may steal home. Just completely takes advantage of Perez. Lost in the sauce. And there's Lindor hitting one deep to right. His second of the day heads toward the wall. It's out of here. 30-30 for Francisco Lindor. Only the fourth Met ever to have a 30 home run, 30 steal season. Lindor hits his second of the game, his third of the doubleheader. Number 30 for Lindor to tie up the game. Line and picked on a hop by Machado from his backside. Gets him! Man, oh man, oh Manny! Manny Machado able to pick that on a hop and from his hip pockets throws him out. You are out. Hey, Tavares, you just got Machado. 
to left, high, deep, back goes Palacios, it's gone! Second home run of the night for Manny Machado, his 30th of the year, puts the Padres on top, 4-2. to two. Man, oh man, oh Manny! Tucker sends one to right field, back goes Santan there, all the way back and gone! He did it, he did it, a grand slam in the ninth! What an event by Kyle Tucker! King Tuck is now invading by sea. Wow. One of the bats of the year in the major leagues. And Altuve sends one high, sends one deep, sends one into the Boston Knight. 13 to 4. Hit number four for Jose Altuve, and he hits for the cycle. There it is. Needed the big one. Got it. Jose Altuve homers for the cycle. 1-0. Marcus Ooh. hits it in the air, deep out to left field. That's got a chance. It is gone! Into the second deck! Career home run number 200 for Marcus Simeon, and it gets us off to a great start this afternoon. It's 1-0. No one pitch. Wit smokes it. Deep to left field. Herrera's back. On to the track. Look it up, it's gone! The piece of Royals history lands in the Hall of Fame seats. It's Bobby Wood Jr.'s 30th home run of the season. And with it, the first player in Royals history to go 30-30. The pitch. Rizzo pops it up down the left field line, tailing foul. Garcia ranges back. Witt sprints over by the tarp, slides, makes a backhand grab. Oh, what a play! Bobby Witt Jr. Sensational again. And that ball is belted. Right center field. Adley Rutschman sends us home with a walk-off homer. The punctuation mark on the Orioles' first home stand. Adley Rutschman sends the Orioles fans home happy and his teammates waiting for him at home plate as he will get the blue Gatorade bath. There goes the runner Marisnik. Rutschman's throw is right into Westberg's glove. Didn't even have to move the tag. Wow. How did he catch that ball? I don't know how he caught it and I don't know how Rutschman got him out either. I mean. Marisnik had an outstanding jump from first base. I mean, it almost felt like no chance at all, but you can't throw one. And how about the scoop? That ball came off the dirt in the Westberg's glove. Watch him straddle the bag and just kind of lean into it, pick it right there, and then apply the tag. And Corbin Carroll might have it right here. Corbin Carroll, goodbye. Well, that's some history right there. Corbin Carroll joins Mike Trout as the only rookies in Major League history with at least 25 home runs and 40 stolen bases. Here goes Corbin. The throw from Bailey is into center field, and that's 50 for Corbin Carroll, who's in at third standing up. 50 for the rookie. Struck him out. Well, Spencer Strider just beat his own record, he said last year, the fastest to 200 strikeouts in Major League history. And he struck out Otani to do it. Payoff pitch. Got him. He's tied John Smoltz at 276. There it is. Number 277 for number 99, Spencer Strider. The most strikeouts in a single season in Atlanta Braves history. And again, the 2 2 pitch. Line drive off the glove of the yes, pitcher. Into yes. right center field. He's got Marsh in. Here comes Marsh. He's heading home. The Phillies have won the ball game. It's a party at Citizens Bank Park. And a high oh. fly ball to deep left field. Rosario's going back, and this game is tied. Trey Turner has done it again. His 26th home run has tied this game up at six. It's number 150 for Trey Turner. A milestone moment. Austin straightens it out, hammers it to center field, and it's gone!
one. What a night for Austin Riley. Two homers, seven RBI, and the Braves are back in front. Line deep, left center field. Gone. Braves lead, fourth homer of the series for Austin Riley. Have a series, huge day in game one with a seven RBI, two home runs, another home run in game two. Helsley fires, and Ramirez with a line drive right center field. It's in the gap. It'll get down and go to the wall. Straw scores the tie run. Here comes Quan. Book it. Mr. Reliable indeed delivers in the bottom of the ninth. And a mob scene out of short. Jose Ramirez. The pitch. And he swings and lines one to deep left field. This ball is gone. It's a line drive, grand slam home run into the Cleveland bullpen in left. This one to left field. Schwarber going back. There's number 50. A two homer night. And now he's one away from Andrew Jones for tying the Braves single season home run record. High in the air. Right center failed. There goes the record setter. Number 52 for Matt Olson. Most home runs in a season in Braves history. First pitch swinging, Andrew Vaughn cracks one to straightaway center. It's deep, Trout is at the wall, he leaps. And he made the catch! Mike Trout robs Andrew Vaughn of a home run. And it's Trout right there. What a play by Mike Trout. We've seen it before. Times everything perfect. Leaps up and pulls this one back. There it goes. Left center field off the bat of Trout. Duran is back at the wall. He leaps. Goodbye. Home run, Mike Trout. He passes DiMaggio on the all-time home run list. And the Angels are up 7-1. to one. And a high fly ball a deep right center field. Oh, Could he have goodness. done it? Renfro's going back toward the wall. It's gone! <laughs> it's number 300! Oh my God. It has given the Phillies the lead. Oh, Bryce Harper has just hit his 300th career home run. He's done it in his 1,481st game. And the Phillies have taken the lead. That one's out to left center field. Harris is on the run. Did he do it? Yes. He did! Two run opposite field home run for Harper. It's his first home run here in September, and the Phillies have stunningly tied this game at eight. Two and two to Julio. Good to see Julio in the batter's box. He was hit on the hand his last time up, but he appears to be fine. Lifted high, deep, right center field. Driven well, back at the wall, and it disappears. Home run, Julio! RBI number 100 this season. Only the third player in baseball history, 22 or younger, to post a 30-30 season while driving in 100 runs. It has been a remarkable sophomore season for Julio Rodriguez. It really has everything that he's done. You mentioned the home runs and the RBIs. How about the stolen bases? The hits that he's been able to pick up this year, leading the league. I mean, he's been tremendous this year. With a 3 0 mark and a 1.40 ERA, 22 strikeouts. Swing and a miss. Down goes Julian. 19th pitch of the inning. Swing and a miss. A late swing. Swing and a miss. Strike three. He has struck out four in a row and six of the last seven. Strike three. Strikeout number nine for Cole. Swing and a miss. Strikeout number 10. And here's Correa. High fly ball, right center. Going back is Judge. Cabrera's there as well. Makes the play. A complete game shutout. Performance. They bring in the lefty Holby Milner here. Jordan sends one deep to left field, all the way back. Yelich, that's a slam! <laughs> Jordan Alvarez hits one out to left, a grand slam, and the Astros up 10 to 1. It does 
doesn't matter. AJ Minter brought in a couple of times in Atlanta, didn't matter. Jose Alvarado in the World Series last year, didn't matter. Robbie Ray in the ALDS, didn't matter. How about your dog? First pitch. First pitch, fastball, middle, middle, 89 miles an hour, right to his strength. He's now with the bases loaded, five for eight, two home runs, 16 RBIs with the bases loaded. Is that I didn't know that. That's new information. What's that? Did you know that Juan Soto does not have a grand slam on his resume? Wow. Yeah. Soto in the air to right field. Back goes Brown at the wall. Juan Soto has his first grand slam. And the Padres take a 10 nothing lead. First grand slam in his great career. Now he plays in Slam Diego. Well, it was only a matter of time. Got on the fastball. I'm trying to get that baseball for him. Hey, Machado trying to get it for him. And the A's do secure it. One pitch, and that one is hit hard. Deep to center field. Dubon back to the wall. Second homer of the game for Corey Seager. And he gets the Rangers back in front. Now Corey Seager does it again, and Corey Seager with this nice, quiet, short swing to the baseball and all the power. And once again, we get a beautiful look here from the side of him squaring a baseball up right on. Freddie Freeman hits this one to right. Fairly deep, and it's over the head of Tucker. Freddie Freeman, the second bet, scores, and welcome to the 2000 hit club, Freddie Freeman. That ball will be kept forever. And Freeman able to do it in front of the home crowd with the second hit tonight. And 2,000th of his career as he tips his cap to the Dodger fans. Have to deal with the shadows, the whole thing. Freddie Freeman goes down, gets it. Sees that his pass tucker, he knows right there, not only does he drive one in, but that's 2,000 as the ball rolls right past him into Brightman's hands. There's a fly ball. Him, Shohei, no moment big enough. Shohei goes yard, tied up. Wow, showtime! Boy, he stayed on that baseball, didn't try to pull it. This is how strong he is. Love that bat flip. Going 106.5. Bat flip about 106.5. Going 403 feet for Shohei. Wow. <laughs> yes, I love that reaction by Andrew Velasquez. Going wow. I guess that answers your question. Can he do it again? He didn't take long. You know, he came into the game with 32, making 33, 34, and 35. Aaron Judge, you can hit. Multiple three home run games this season. First Yankee all time to do that. The crowd wants to love him. Mookie Hammer. Derby ready, folks! 
25 before the break. Breaking ball off. It could have been a cutter that didn't cut as much as he wanted, and Mookie just got enough. Front row counts as much as the back row. Ronald goes. There it is. He did it. A 40-70 season and a season unlike any other in Major League Baseball history for Ronald Acuna Jr. Take the base and take a bow, number 13.